Hello and welcome. My name is Necro and today I'm using a brand new mic. Among other things. So, yeah. Anyway, today we're going to be continuing with episode 3. I have not played episode 2 for quite a while. Because to be fair, I was doing episode 1 halfway through a different series. I mean, this is how far far behind you can tell I am, because I've still got episode 4 and episode 5. But yeah, this should be interesting. Hmm. I think they may have changed the, um, stuff. Anyway, without further ado, here we are. Last time, well, we're going to get a rundown anyway. But yeah, so hopefully this new mic should be good. I've tested it a little bit, but I find the best way to actually learn something is to Previously on go ahead Minecraft and do story it. Mode. And learn from your mistakes. Plus, this isn't exactly life or death, so I can try that. The world can be a very scary place. Ah, the fucking hell, he's giving the monologue. And almost impossible to defeat. The stress of saving the world can turn even the best of friends against each other. And not everyone will be on your side. I made the right choice. Some will try to take advantage of your kindness. Like that but a bitch. true hero will know exactly what to do. And will inspire others to do the same. I might have made the wrong choice. I was doing that more to be nice to her rather than the scariest thing of all, even for the bravest hero, is betrayal. Is discovering the villain is much closer than you think. I don't know why he went for the snowman look. Still. I need to have a good talking to to that villain. Because I think he would benefit from some therapy. I'm being fully serious though. I'll go into it more in later points, but... Yeah. This is that kind of villain. The kind who, oddly enough, is misunderstood, even though it's pretty easy to understand that he's got near-omnipotent power. Whee! Oh damn, he took my armor. Oh, and he undressed me. What the heck is this? That's nice. Uh, where's my stuff? The gauntlet! I hope Petra's okay wearing it. Gotta get back, find the admin, find my friends. The guest will kindly follow the orange line in the floor to the check-in zone. Well, I mean, will kindly follow the orange line in the floor to the check-in zone. Uh, it's it, it's a recording. A ham. Rope clearing sound. Oh wait, no. It's not. The guest will kindly follow the oh, orange the line, line in the floor to the check-in check zone. zone. Yeah, I heard you. Or maybe it is. I don't. <laughs> I'm not sure. The guest will kindly follow the orange line in the floor to the check-in zone, or else they get the lava on the line. Crap. She's got it. Point made. Well, I guess that explains why I'm actually going to follow this line, because the preview said this is a prison. Oh, look. An orange line. What a peculiar place. Bedrock? The admin said a place where I'd never see the light of day again. Yeah, he's kind of a dick. That's. What is this place? I mean, why not just kill him? I mean, I feel like maybe he's trying to, like, egg him on to keep going, but. So, Jesse, how was your day? Oh, it was great. Met a red, glowy, all powerful, crazy person who trapped me in a near indestructible cage. <sighs> and Jesse's already going crazy. 
I'm sure this is leading me to a place full of sunshine and cheer. <laughs> sunshine. Ooh. Yo, weird looking. Why are you following the orange line? Oh, don't mind Big Hank. He's just here to make sure all guests behave themselves. Guest. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh, yes, Jesse. Welcome to the Sunshine Institute. It's a reformatory for people the admin has found difficult. Oh, a lot of people. I'll be your warden. So the admin created this nut hut too, huh? Of course. The admin is an endless source of building brilliance. Including this beautiful behavioral adjustment retreat center. I'm sure we'll get along just famously. Maybe we'll even be uh, friends someday. So it's a prison. Hey, no, no, we don't use the P word here. Oh, for goodness sake. But it is a prison. Let's not challenge authority. The admin doesn't let us use that word, so we don't use that word. Understand? Why doesn't he let you know it? No, he's not here right now, right? You never know. Ooh. It's weird to think the admin is so well known. Beautiful, there would have been more stuff. The fuck? What about my friends? I need to get back. The admin put his gauntlet on one of them. Who knows what he's making them do? He gave them the gauntlet? Oh, man, lucky them. What does that the gauntlet actually the do? the admin's favorite. <laughs> How great would that be? I bet your friend is living it up. Enjoying the high life right by the admin's side. It really doesn't last long. The admin's a finicky little tyrant. That's exactly the kind of attitude that got you sent here. And if your friends are anything like you, they'll be making their journey to Betterment right next to you, I'm sure. Now hang on a tick. I have a, another guest on my manifest. Male, grizzled beard. Hair is described as majestic. <laughs> Long... Long list of aliases. Hey, distract here. him. Yeah, that's Jack. Oh my gosh. Oh, Jesse, thank goodness I found you. This I place know. is. Let's get out of here. Wait, you can't. It's too dangerous. Stop them, associates. Believe what a mess we're in. Well, that didn't oh, last long. I didn't realize Foss was actually the admin. Yeah, it's all your oh, fault. <laughs> what a mess. Manipulated, shammed, ashamed. Don't give up yet, though, okay? You still got me, Nerm, Petra. Where's Nerm? Yeah. What did we leave him behind? Now the admin has Petra, too. Oh, no. The I, person who kept trying to ditch me is I gone. I'm going to get out of this one. chance without weapons. Can we run? Where? Wherever they aren't. Put them to the other guy. Like Stop Radar them. and Lucas. Don't let them reach the burrows. What's up the burrows? <laughs> I'm gonna be honest, I thought this was gonna be like a prison break thing, which it kind of is, but... This isn't exactly... Oh no, I'm trapped, I need to bide my time. This is more just fucking run!
Okay, we've got to figure out where we are. What is that? Ooh, spider. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Those zombies? Oh, please tell me they dance. Please tell me they dance. I've, I've got a I've got a joke about the distracting dancing zombies, but it's too it, it's too inappropriate. This thing is endless! about now yeah maybe not this way you know this isn't the first maze they've had well it's probably the first Jack's had to get through but Jesse's gone through a maze like this before Ooh. Reaper? Nightmares are made of. That is unsettling. of course why would there be only one it's never just one oh no oh no oh no Geez, that's some powerful creeper if it blew that up. Uh -oh. That's actually pretty normal looking. Hello. This is getting bonkers. Bonkers. Gotcha. 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 Oh. Nice moves. Uh -oh. Look, Jesse. We gotta get to the top of that wall. Why that wall? Oh, right, yeah, because this is probably the only one we can get onto. Damn. Oh, crud. Golem! Hello. Did we get captured? Ah, oh, we did. Five minutes and already apprehended in an escape attempt. That is just. That is just rude. Take this one to the mushroom. Creepy. And bring that one to my office. Now. 